Hey everybody, how's it going? It is Axel Graven. I'm back with more reactions with an X. This time, happy to bring you another episode of Tax Op Destiny. I believe we're on episode four, and I'm super excited. We unfortunately had to take a short break last week just because of personal issues, and we were late this week. However, we are getting back on track, uh, you know, streaming late, but we're going to have our song on right. With that said, we, uh, we're going into episode four, and I want to give a special shout out to the patrons who, for as low as a dollar a month, will get access to that video and audio fully uncut all the same stuff that came out on crunchyroll uh and then on youtube we have to do the cuts just because youtube makes us otherwise i'd love to just watch it with you guys for free all the time if i could uh but you know there are things in life precluding that uh you know stuff like bills and copyright infringement and adult bullshit but we're gonna go ahead and get into this episode of the anime um you know it should be a fun time and i'm hoping that it will be just as well written animated and composed as the previous three episodes which have honestly been some of the best anime i have watched in years my friends honestly it's still too early in the season to put it down but honestly on the levels of like cowboy bebop and things even for its time on animation now it, it's just so good with that said we're gonna go ahead and get right in august 25th 2047 and he's all fucked up again because she's out there wrecking shit <laughs> i love the explosion stuff though that oh it's like a bull this time oh they're training look at her dude she's she missing she missing she missing oh maybe he's missing yeah. <laughs> Watching the difference between her like pop shotgun and whatever cannon energy weapon. Oh god. Hmm. Oh my god, you can hear that so loud, the wood creak. Oh my god. I can't even put my foot down with the plug. Bro, I've never had that problem before. Lang. That's just his character. Oh, American food too, they did American food. It's a corn party. Corn buns, vegetable soup, corn on the cob. They're going out hunting, I'm assuming. That or they're dipping, but I, I don't think they're dipping yet. They're, they should be in the story for a little while longer. Oh, he did go to them. He's gonna let him play and he brought money, right? A, a fat stack of US bills, dog. What the fuck? Do I knew that guy was a sleazeball, too. Oh no, is there something in their house? Huh? Don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> Goodbye to your window. She is an idiot. <laughs> it's actually tragic now because it's supposed to be funny when she does that. It's actually tragic. It's a double edge, right? Because for her, yeah, yeah, it's funny. She's going off with when each other. What it's really is, it's like her little sister running off and she can't do anything about it. Oh, don't get, don't get jacked up being too big for your britches. Oh, move, bitch. Get out the fucking way. Oh. 
All right, uh, we already kind of assumed and knew because she was carrying that giant gun around like nothing. But uh, super strength confirmed. Uh, basically, super speed, super human reactions. Um, I mean, she looks like a machine. She looks like a highly advanced machine almost. Of course. Oh, that's what he meant by play, and I thought he meant play music, but he meant gambling. Alright, here comes another fight scene. Animation has been on point. Sorry if I'm a bit distracted, Vay. Oh, there's a lot of guns. Oh, D2s. Oh, one, two, not just one, two, three, okay. Oh, and they're like roly polies. I love the design choice already on all these D2s. They're all after like animals of different kinds. I think we have like monkeys and and then they have like different attributes, each of them, right? Like this one is still kind of like the other ones, but it's like more of this roly poly. Ah, look, it's, oh my God, she's pretty. That's so weird. Ah, that gun. That's a bad plan. She has no idea. Meanwhile, she's just like, hello. Look at her hair. It, it, the distinct design between the two of them are both striking and beautiful, but just so different from each other. They're unique. Okay, so we're stealing one from earlier. And it goes right into the thing. <laughs> That's so cool. The way she does that was badass, bro. Just, wow, bitch. <laughs> they got the kickback good. Just the sword. I don't even think we've seen uh, if the other one has a sword. I think that's just part of his, though. Took the arm. Went in for the up. Another arm. And then the switch up to the ba 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 bang Yep, I thought so. Oh, she got the laser pointer. The music, though, is lit. It's on point, guys. I still have this feeling Lenny's up to something real rough. There's a lot going on he's not telling us for sure. I just don't know what it is. That was a great episode. Um, I don't know if it was necessarily as good as the ones before. This one was kind of a mid-episode. I think it was still well-made in pretty much all the aspects. I just didn't feel it was necessarily that engaging. It was more of a mid-episode to be like, all right, this is how they learned how to, you know, do all that stuff. But, yeah. I don't know, man. That's just me. I, I do think that uh, it was well done and I enjoyed it. I don't think it was quite as good as the other episodes, but it may come back to play because there's a lot going on in the episode as far as, like, kind of maybe little hints of the story the stuff going on in vegas the, the things what's up with the d2s why were they in Ve like there's a lot of little questions that very much could come to play later and they could make this episode important but i think this episode very much is just more of a mid way episode as well as a mid episode you know it's not super great um it's not bad by any means either and it definitely has a purpose in the story you know what i mean um, I just don't know if maybe you needed a full episode for this, but it once again might come back later to kind of, you know, show us exactly what's going down. With that said, guys, I really did enjoy watching with you. I hope you enjoyed watching with me. And as always, if you want to keep watching with me, you can check out all our stuff live on Twitch. We go once a week broadcasting all this stuff. We release three videos a week on YouTube. Uh, we try to post a bunch of different stuff whenever we can. And, you know, we love to talk with all of our patrons in Discord. So if you check out the link below to our Discord, you can come and chat with us there about anything, anime, music, games, uh, the shows we react to and all that great stuff, music, whatever. And yeah, it's just going to be a very, very 
fun time watching this, I think. But this episode, not that it was bad, just that it wasn't as amazing as the three before. The three episodes before this really were very high class, quality and high class um, in every step, including plot. And I think this one is pretty much high quality and everything except for plot. And it's not that it's low quality plot, quality quad. It's not that it's low quality plot, just that this is more of a, I guess, not filler episode, but midway episode. There's not much really happening in this episode that is meant to be big, as far as I can tell currently. Now, it may be big later, but not right now. With that said, maybe I missed a bunch of stuff. If you wanted to point stuff out that I missed, absolutely feel free to. If you want to talk with us about Tacked Off Destiny, feel free to. And if you just want to, you know, check out more of the episodes, also feel free to do that. You know, feel free to do whatever you want. That's it. I'm Axel Grave. I really enjoyed watching with you guys, and I'll see you next time on Reactions with the next Tech Doc.